hello team and welcome back to the channel so i'll keep this video short because it's an announcement video and i'm going to explain you now what exactly you can expect in the upcoming master class of master uh, azure devops okay so first of all team uh, it's completely free so you can directly register it and you can attend the live master class of this azure devops i know lots of you have already requested to make a video on azure devops that's why i'm conducting this master class so for those people who are new to azure devops they can learn very easily now talking about what exactly you can expect first of all team you know once you complete this master class you will have the knowledge of proper azure devops so that you can add it in your resume as well along with the project i'll be explaining those things in the master class ki how you can add it what kind of task you need to add uh, with respect to uh, azure devops okay secondly it will be like exactly the same way the way that we can do in companies same way it's going to be so that you can know you can understand how exactly uh, like azure devops pipelines are created and how they are uh, like used in companies okay what exactly we are going to do in this master class so we are going to first of all set up azure devops platform then we are going to push our source code inside azure devops organization write the ci pipeline in ci pipeline we are going to integrate maven docker then uh, sonar cube trivi all those tools we are going to integrate it side by side instead of nexus we are going to use azure artifacts okay once we have done all those things then this will be the ci pipeline first pipeline is going to be the ci pipeline for building of the application after that we are going to create a release or cd pipeline that is going to perform the deployment so in cd pipeline you can write these steps or like task like where exactly you want to deploy the application if you want to deploy to self hosted kubernetes cluster if you want to deploy to aks cluster if you want to deploy to eks cluster all those things you can configure once that is done you can deploy the application there now best part we will be automating this whole process that means ki as soon as we push any source code inside the specific branch it's going to trigger the ci pipeline which is going to build the new version of application once ci pipeline is completed it's going to trigger the cd or release pipeline okay so in this way everything will be completely automated and we just need to make some changes to our specific branch okay so yeah all these things you'll be getting completely for free so make sure to register all the links will be in the description so make sure to check it out okay and that's all for uh, today's video team